Hillary Clinton signs copies of her new book, What Happened, during a book signing event in New York in September. Getty Images' Hillary Clinton said Wednesday that she was sick, shocked and appalled by the allegations of sexual harassment and assault against Harvey Weinstein, the disgraced Hollywood mogul, a longtime Democratic donor who was friendly with the Clintons. I was appalled. It was something that was just intolerable in every way, she told CNN's Fareed Zakaria in an interview. And, you know, like so many people who've come forward and spoken out, this was a different side of a person who I and many others had known in the past. Clinton said that she would have considered Weinstein a friend, and that she did not know anything about Weinstein's alleged misconduct before the revelations in the New York Times last week, followed by a story in the New Yorker magazine and another Times article this week. I certainly didnt, and I don't know who did, she told the network. But I can only speak for myself, and I think speak for many others who knew him primarily through politics. Democrats in recent days have come under fire for being recipients of Weinstein's political contributions, with Republicans immediately demanding that they return money from the movie producer. Kellyanne Conway, a White House counselor, lambasted Clinton for her delay in condemning Weinstein, while CNN's Wolf Blitzer and the Republican National Committee chairwoman Ronna Romney McDaniel said that Clinton's silence is deafening. Clinton issued a statement via her spokesman on Tuesday, five days after the story first broke, saying that she was shocked and appalled by the revelations about Harvey Weinstein. Clinton said Wednesday that she would give away any of Weinstein's contributions. I give 10% of my income to charity every year, this will be part of that, Clinton said. There's no, there's no doubt about it. Weinstein and his family have given more than $1.4 million in political contributions to the Democratic Party since 1992, including $10,000 to Obama, and $46,350 to Clinton and HILLPAC, a political action committee that Clinton used to support other Democrats while she was a senator. In response to the Republicans' criticisms, several Democrats, including Sen. Patrick Leahy DVT, Sen. Martin Heinrich DN, M. Sen. Richard Blumenthal DCT, and Sen. Elizabeth Warren D. Mass, have pledged to transfer to charity any money they had received in donations from Weinstein. The Democratic Congressional Campaign Committee announced Tuesday that it, too, would give away to charity all donations from Weinstein. Some of the most high-profile Democratic players have publicly denounced Weinstein. On Tuesday, former President Barack Obama issued a statement saying that he and Michelle are disgusted by the recent reports about Weinstein. On Wednesday, former Vice President Joe Biden joined in on the condemnation, calling Weinstein's behavior disgusting, immoral, and inexcusable. In the interview, Clinton praised the bravery of women who have come forward to speak out against Weinstein, accusing him of making unwanted sexual advances. The courage of these women coming forward now is really important because it can't just end with one person's disgraceful behavior and the consequences that he is now facing, she said. This has to be a wake-up call and shine a bright spotlight on anything like this behavior anywhere, at any time. In the days since the allegations against Weinstein were first publicized, the movie producer has been fired as co-chairman of the Weinstein Company, which he had co-founded with his brother. On Tuesday, his wife of 10 years, Georgina Chapman, announced that she was leaving him. While Weinstein initially apologized for his behavior, he has also unequivocally denied any allegations of non-consensual sex, spokeswoman Sally Hoffmeister said in a statement to the Post. Read more Georgina Chapman is leaving Harvey Weinstein amid sexual harassment accusations, report says Gwyneth Paltrow, Angelina Jolie, Cara Delevingne join the growing list of Harvey Weinstein accusers.